Hi, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Vanessa's Van Life Journey. How are you guys doing? Come on in and thumbs up the video if you are my friend. I have been uh, exposing you guys to an auction that is in Humble, Texas, Richie Brother Auctions. They have online auctions and they have the auctions in several different cities and different states. So you have to go online and sign up and they will notify you and you can select this location that you are interested in looking at. So today I want to talk price. Uh, these will sell at auction in the near future, but I just want to let you know like if you're going to be bidding on these vehicles what would be a good range to bid at so uh if you can get this these vehicles for five thousand dollars ten thousand dollars to fifteen thousand dollars uh i believe that that would be a very good price uh, most of these vehicles are going to have over a hundred thousand miles on them but they are usually going to be highway miles and these vehicles are going to be a vehicle that you can stand up in and that you can easily do a van bill in if you service these vehicles uh this can be a lifetime van home for you uh, a lot of people are buying these types of vans from dealerships having them financed and the dealerships are are selling them for like twenty five thirty thousand dollars and that's not including the finance charges so if you can purchase one of these vans from auction for 15 from 10 to 15 even twenty thousand dollars i think that would be a good deal cash me personally i would pay between 10 and fifteen thousand dollars for one of these vans and uh keep in mind that you're going to have to pay your tax title and license so uh if you are interested in a van like this make sure you stay uh on the lookout for uh richie brothers auctions if you are in the texas area they also have these auctions in houston and fort worth texas and uh if you're in another city that's not too far that's a couple of hours drive it would be worth it to come down here and uh if you have a vehicle a camper that you can stay in come down here look at the vans then go online and uh bid on the vans if you win the bid on one of the vans then you can cash out go in the next day pay for it and uh be on your way and so I hope that this information is helpful to you guys. Some of the vehicles may need more work than others, depending on what you prefer to bid on. It's all what you prefer to bid on. When they have vans like these, they have at least five good vans that I would consider bidding on. So when they have a number of vans like those, pick out the one you want the most and bid on that one. Uh, in my case, the one I want the most would be the last one. So if the other ones go out cheap enough, you may consider one of them or you may be all or nothing for the last one. If the one you mo want the most is bidded on first, then you can bid up to your limit. And then after that, if the other ones, uh, if you can't get that one and you can't win the bid on that one, if you want to and you don't want to wait for another auction to come up in the future, then you can bid on one of the other ones if they are going out cheaper than the one you wanted the most. I wouldn't pay as much for the one you uh, for the other ones that you really didn't want that would that would be an alternative uh, if the one that you wanted the most went out for more than what you wanted to pay for it. And so let me give you an example. The one you wanted the most went out for $20,000. That was your max. But you want, but the one you wanted the least is also going out for $20,000. I wouldn't pay $20,000 for the one I wanted the least. I would max out what I can max out on the one I wanted the most. And if I can't get that one, then hopefully I can get the ones that I wanted the least for a little bit cheaper, say ten to $15,000. So I hope this information is helpful to you guys. Uh, and if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments bar below. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell to be notified each and every time I upload a new video. 
video and don't forget to share this video with some of your friends and family members who are interested in van life and let them know that they can get a vehicle cheaper uh, than what they can get it for from the dealership even if it's used and have miles on it because I'm telling you the dealerships are selling these same vehicles with 130 140 and 150 and 60,000 miles they're selling them for like 20 25 30 thousand dollars so if you can come to auction and get these vehicles for 10 15 and 20 thousand dollars that would be a great deal also one of my subscribers mentioned to me which i already knew but i forgot uh if you go check out these vans in person buy the little tool or gadget where you can put it on the van and do a diagnostic test on it and see if any check engines or any serious things come up with it uh most of these vehicles are being retired they don't have any serious uh mechanical issues with them but it's always great to double check and just to know a little bit more about what you are getting also if you um have a mechanic friend you can take a mechanic with you if you are serious about bidding on one of these vehicles you can probably pay a mechanic friend a hundred to two hundred dollars to go with you and check out the vehicle or you can ask your mechanic friend to show you what to look for uh you can check the oil check the dipstick of the oil see if the oil is black you can start up the vehicle and when you look out the back of the exhaust make sure there is no smoke coming out and you can also start the engine let it run for a while and see if there are any leaks underneath the vehicle and you can also get up under the vehicle and see if there is any rust because you don't know what state the vehicle came from and another good tip as well is some of the vehicles still have the uh tag on them so if you can see when the last time that vehicle was registered that could also be some helpful information as well uh so if you guys have any tips on buying a vehicle from the auction things you should look for things you should know uh things do's and don'ts from buying a vehicle from the auction uh leave those tips in the comment bar below so anyway you guys i hope this video was helpful uh let me know in the comments bar below if this video is helpful if you knew anything about auctions if this is your first time learning about them through my channel and let me know if uh being exposed to this information is going to be helpful to you and if you would consider purchasing one of these vehicles from the auction in the future don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and leave a lot of comments in the comments bar below don't forget to thumbs up the video to let me know that you want me to keep this kind of content coming and don't forget to share this video with a family member loved one who may be interested in van life and would like to purchase a vehicle from van life this could save them a lot of money thanks for watching bye now love you guys